This is the first Golf Cabriolet in nine years. But what we've got here is Blue Motion. And of course, that links with the diesel engined 1.6. Also available initially at least will be the 1.2 TSI and a 1.4 TSI. This particular model will cost you just over 23,000. The range between lowest and highest figure, talking 20 to 26K. This engine will emit 105 PS. It is quality defined. Now that is clever. The roof was retracted, but there was no reduction in load space at all. Also, I'm able to retract the seats from this position using those latches. Now, of course, here is a wind deflector and it reveals two seats, and they aren't occasional seats, proper full-size seats for adults there with legroom to suit. I was also got auto start, start the standard and regenerative braking. We're taking the wind deflector off for the cameraman to sit in the back and it is still a fairly quiet ride and certainly very smooth with no detectable scuts or shake that you often get with the older cabriolets. Doing a constant 60 miles per hour, about 1700 RPM. A little bit predictable though, I think, from Volkswagen. Job done. Now this particular model will cost you just over 23,000. But stressing that this 1.6 diesel emits 105 PS. Now I mention that because about five years ago I drove a Passat to diesel and that had the same PS. So that's a lot for a 1.6. Now the roof is fully up and we're just over 60 miles per hour here and uh, very smooth. This is what we expect from Volkswagen quality and refinement. It's a shame they didn't bring it out earlier. <laughs> 